Hey everyone, Dave here. Welcome to No More Rainbows Overview. Um, I have literally no idea what I have just watched. Essentially the trailer didn't tell me shit, so I need to just read the description. So the setting is that it's a reverse good versus evil thing, and it's like an arcade dish with some kind of campaign platformer. Okay, <laughs> now it's more clear. I'm very glad for unique concepts, but make it also clear for the audience. So No More Rainbows is an arcade platformer where, as a beast from the underworld, you have to destroy all happiness that's out there and rampage through colorful worlds in order to reclaim your desecrated underworld. I mean, okay, I guess it's a platformer, so it's kind of my thing. Though, just from reading the description and stuff like that, it doesn't seem like there is some story-driven stuff going on. So I guess it's essentially gonna be just destruction, mayhem and carnage. It also has multiplayer mode, which is pretty interesting, like, I guess, besides Carly and the Reaper man, I don't think we had a situation like that before. It's hard to tell anything, like, because it's art style trailer, like, of course, I can just look up the gameplay and stuff like that, but it's not the point. But you just pretty much put yourself in the levels and destroy everything that's moving, and that's how you progress, so... I don't know, we'll see with the gameplay. It's a little bit weird tactic to not show literally any footage whatsoever. So I'm pretty much buying a cat in the back, which I'm not necessarily happy about. Let's go to the some gameplay. <laughs> okay, we have some storyline. Why this crease going down? Oh, this is the gorilla tag thing. Jesus. <laughs> Shit, shit. Okay, but are there settings? Doesn't seem like it. Because <laughs> I want to disable this vignette. I mean, I don't necessarily love this way of locomotion. At least I can turn, which is an upgrade. There are really no settings? No, I'm not turning my body. This is gonna be a workout today. Okay. What is going on here? <laughs> Stop this party! Jesus! 
The movement is what gets me. No. It's because this movement, it will never be accurate, so it's just a struggle. It's just not my style at all. For example, though, that's why. Oh my god. No barbecue. Ah, oh, so cute. Wait, what the? Still can't access the settings. <laughs> Graffiti. I mean, actually, now looking around, the art style is not that polished as I would think it would be. It's blocky, sharp edges, there are some details, but not a whole lot. Island. Okay, so this is the main hub. Can we get some settings, please? I don't think there actually is. Neither with buttons nor in the environment, like... I can already tell I'm gonna hate the experience purely because the gorilla attack movement is not for me. But, who we'll say? Is she actually evil or me? Because... I think she's being the annoying one. They're just hanging around, minding their own business. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Wait, how many? Hundred and ten? There's some physics going on. Oh, I can throw them. Thanks for telling me now. Wait, can I actually? 
No, like, even with the touch. If the game would have normal locomotion, I feel like it would be like game changing. <laughs> Cause it's just annoying to me. And I'm being annoyed, I know, but... Like it's just... Gorilla attack with platformer mechanics. And it's just not accurate, it's tiring, it's annoying, like... I don't see it for me. I have to be well versed in this category, like if I would be a gorilla tag enthusiast I might have been excellent here, but that's just not what's happening. It's a struggle. And I'll end it here because I'm just not enjoying it. And there's no point in <laughs> a struggle. I think the cutesy art style is fine. I feel like it could be a little bit better in terms of just the polishing the textures and the edges because I know that the headset can handle it. There are some physics going on. Hate the movement, but you already know that. There's no settings to change that or the vignette so it's a very dumbed down experience that you can't even modify or if there is a way it's not very clear to me <sighs> i just i don't like it even if it's a platformer so it should be my thing the whole setting is pretty interesting because it's not something that you see nowadays like you being an evil entity or I'm not sure about in that category. So you just travel around, hit some stuff, then travel higher. I wish I would be able to grab them, or maybe I can, but couldn't even notice that. I think it's just not for me. So I'm just blabbing around and I'll complain more and more, which there's no point to it. 